Hello everyone, thanks for joining me again on this demo for Pharaoh's software called Build It Construction. Alright, today we'll be discussing a quick way to create a floor flatness deviation map with the software. Some of the major benefits uh, you can see for doing the floor flatness deviation maps are analyzing all surfaces of the floor quickly and accurately, having the ability to locate errors precisely within minutes and still while the concrete is wet and workable. Imagine costs and potential schedule delays with having to add grinding and other tasks to the schedule. Or imagine scanning an existing floor before remodel to understand what the floor elevation is doing before price is complete. And the construction of stud wall starts so you can have a flat plane to start from. So today we're going to complete a floor flatness test on the scan data. So to complete a floor flatness test on scan data, you just need to import an FLS scene project file or another file type that build it allows. Then use your split cloud command to remove unneeded data you don't need to analyze. This also helps speed up the processing by not having all those points in the view. Next, you'll want to create a plane based off where the deviation will color the points from. To do this, select the Extract tool right here, then pick the point cloud, and then select Apply. Now that you have your plane, it's just selecting the Surface Deviation command. The first step here is to select the plane, and then the point cloud. I suggest using the spyglass here to review your results before applying. Then you can make any adjustments to the search distance or analysis display as needed. When you are happy with the results, then you can click apply. Thanks again everybody for joining me for Farrell's Build It Construction Software Demo. This is Brady O'Brien, and check out more Build It Construction demos online.